Thank you for your interest in Love the Drive wind deflectors. This is an installation guide for 2005 to 2008 Toyota Celera convertibles. As you'll see, the wind deflectors pop in and out of your Celera in a matter of seconds. There are no alterations or modifications needed to your 2005-2008 Celera. It goes in, it attaches to the back to the rear of your car using plungers, two straps into the front, and that's it. Our goal at Love the Drive is to make our wind deflectors as easy and simple to install as possible. Your Solera has two small holes in the rear quarter trim panels. Your wind deflector attaches to these using plungers. You pull the plunger back, lower it down, align it to the hole, and release. It's that simple, that easy. To remove the wind deflector, you pull up, let the plunger release, and away you go. Your wind deflector comes with two straps. These straps attach to the bottom trim panel. You then adjust the height of the buckle, attach the strap to the female portion of the buckle, give it a snug pull. Don't forget to do it to the other side. And that's it. It's that simple. To remove the wind deflector, similarly, just unbuckle the two straps, lower the top panel, pull the plunger back, lift it up, and then slide the wind deflector out. Always make sure that you hang on to the wind deflector so it doesn't slide around. Now to recap, you place the wind deflector into the rear seat, you pull the plunger down, release it into the hole, attach the two straps, and you're ready to go. This wind deflector is only for 2005 to 2008 Solera models. The 2004 model is similar, however, it does not have the holes in the trim panel needed for this wind deflector. And that's it. Once you get used to it, you can have this wind deflector in and out of your car in minutes. When not in use, you can store the wind deflector in the trunk. The picture didn't show the storage bag, but it does come with one. Go out and love the drive.